Hi guys, today I'm going to talk the 10 best beaches in Brazil. Everyone agrees that the coastline of Brazil is one of the most amazing in the world, but what if you had to choose which are the best beaches in Brazil among the 7,000 kilometers of its coast? So, in this video I made a list of the 10 best beaches to travel in Brazil. We have videos of some of the best beaches in each state and city. Please check in our channel, leave your like and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to put your contribution at the end of this video in the comment box. So, let's start! Number 10. Praia do Espelho or Mirror Beach, located in Porto Seguro, Bahia. Our list starts with the place where Brazil was discovered. Praia do Espelho is located in Porto Seguro, Bahia. The region is also known as the Discovery Coast. Many people get to know the beach through the day trips, but it's also possible to stay at one of the best beaches in Brazil. As the price of inns there are high, it is necessary to take this into account. Praia do Espelho stands out for being much quieter beach than its neighborhoods Arraial da Ajuda and Trancoso. Access is only by dirt road and local prices are higher. For those who go, uh, the reward is finding that beautiful beach full of cliffs and natural pools, especially at low tide. But unlike other Brazilian beaches, it is important to warn that the pools are not so pleasant for bathing. In the best sea and wind conditions, the water forms a true water mirror, just to find the name of the place. Better to take advantage of the tents and beach structure with charming loungers, it is necessary to pay a minimum consumption in most places. Beach number 9, Bainha dos Golfinhos. Praia da Pipa, Rio Grande do Norte. Praia da Pipa is one of the favorite places from people from the Northeast region. You can stay there or in Natal, capital of Rio Grande do Norte. Pipa is a district in the municipality of Tibaú do Sul and has a very charming touch both in its bustling center and on the beaches with, with its cinematic cliffs. One of the most incredible places in Pipa is Chapadão and its wonderful view of Praia do Amor, unmissable photo. But Pipa's beaches are very crowded, so it's worth to walk to a hidden paradise, surrounded by cliffs and only accessible on foot or by boat, that is called Bainha dos Golfinhos, is, and, is, and it is extremely reserved. Bainha dos Golfinhos was included in the list of the 10 beaches in the world in 2022 on the TripAdvisor website. It's ranked in ninth place. The beach is a refugee not only for those who want to escape from the crowds, but also for dolphins. The name of the beach is not for nothing. Golfinho means dolphins. It is possible to see dolphins when swimming in the sea from there. You need to go a little deeper, but it's it's possible. Cacimba do Padre, located in Fernando de Noronha, is our eighth beach. Fernando de Noronha is that dream place for all travelers, so you could make a list of the best beaches of Brazil just with places with this archipelago. But one of the best beaches in Noronha is Cacimba do Padre, the beach that gives access to Bahia dos Porcos and the best place to see Dois Irmãos, a postcard of the island. While other beaches are more controlled by staying within the Parque Nacional Marinho de Fernando de Noronha area, Cacimba do Padre is a more relaxed beach where you can really sit and enjoy the whole day. The beach has restaurants, beach facilities and one of the best places to enjoy the sunset in Noronha. Finally, it is, it is worth mentioning that this beach changes according to the time of the, the year. In summer, the beach is very popular with surfers and has many waves. In other seasons, the sea is calmer for bathing with crystal clear waters. The seventh beach is Quarta Praia. Morro de São Paulo, state of Bahia. 
Morro de São Paulo is one of the best destinations in Brazil, bringing together beaches with calm and crystalline waters, in addition to good accommodation options. Access to the island is only by boat, which guarantees the pleasant climate of enjoying a place without cars, where you can only get around on foot or by boat. But don't expect to so much peace of mind. Mode São Paulo has a busy nightlife with several restaurants, bars and even a beach party, also known as Luau. The fourth beach is the most beautiful on the island, with turquoise blue water, natural pools with lots of fish and good structure of restaurants by the sea, the beach has all the ingredients for a perfect beach. The fourth beach of Morro de São Paulo entered in the list of the 10 beaches in the world in 2022 on TripAdvisor website, it ranked fourth. The sixth beach that we are talking about is Praia dos Carneiros, located in Pernambuco. Porto de Galinha has already established itself as one of the best destinations in Brazil, but because of that it ended up becoming a very crowded and busy place. For those looking for a quieter option, but not too much, it is worth betting on the paradisical Praia dos Carneiros. The term paradise may seem a bit cliche, but every time we think of, of crystalline waters, coconut trees by the sea, and many natural pools, we can't think of another word. The beach has a good structure of tents, such as Bora Bora or the Beiju, Beiju Pira restaurant. Prices are not cheap, but nothing out of the ordinary either. It is worth the investment to enjoy one of the best beaches in Brazil. In addition, it is super worth walking to the Capela São Benedito facing the sea. There are people who dream getting married there, but no matter how rustic and simple the little church looks, making that dream come through costs a lot of money, costs a fortune. The fifth beach is Praia de Lopes Mendes in Ilha Grande. Rio de Janeiro. Ilha Grande is a place you have to go if you're going to Rio or Sao Paulo. You will love the atmosphere of the place and the fact that there are no cars so the only means of transportation is on your feet or by boat. For the lazy ones, boat trips are the option. They lead both to nearby beaches such as Praia do Abraãozinho and to the most distant ones such as Praia do Aventureiro. The big star of Ilha Grande is Praia de Lopes Mendes, the absolutely crystalline sea water is one of them that makes you want to drink the water, it's so pure, but please do not drink it. The beach has no infrastructure, there are only few street vendors on busy days, so take your things and enjoy a whole day there. Fourth beach is Jericoacoara. Yeah, let me. Yeah, that's your turn to say. Jericoacoara Beach. It's not the prettiest of Sierra, but the vibe of the place is so cool that it wins any heart. The daily ritual is to choose a nice play to, place to enjoy. The sunset Duna do Pôr do Sol is not even the only option. The streets of the village of Jericoacoara are all made of sand, but the place has a unique charm. Delicious restaurants, excellent inns and hotels, and just the right structure standing on the sand. And besides, Jerry still has unmissable tours such as Lagoa do Paraíso, the tour to Tatajuba, and the new Blue Hole. All this contributes to Jerry being one of the least of the best beaches in Brazil. Third beach. The beaches from Arraial do Cabo. We could even have chosen Praia do Farol, which has already taken over uh, one of the best beaches in Rio State. But the truth is that any beach in Arraial is wonderful and easily enter in the list of the best beaches in Brazil. But if we had to choose, the best ones at the top of the list are Praia do Farol, Prainhas do Pontal do Atalaia, and Praia do Forno. With calm waters and super crystalline 
sea in shades of Caribbean blue standing in front of any of the beaches in Rayal do Cabo is a moment of admiration. Everyone already knows, but it's always good to warn. The sea is super cold, no matter the season. In the, in the heat, it becomes easier to bear. In winter, we even get out of the sea shivering, but you can get in. We even saw penguins there. Unfortunately, unfortunately Arraial do Cabo has little structure to receive the amount of visitors it, it is receiving. In high season, the excess of people greatly hinders this experience. So avoid like uh, December, January and February, for sure. Second beach is Praia de São Miguel dos Milagres. The coast of Alagoas is one of the most beautiful in Brazil, between Maceió, state of Alagoas, and Tamandaré, state of Pernambuco. It is located the APA, Costa dos Corais, an area of reefs and natural pools. Despite Maragogi being the most famous destination on the coast, the city ended up getting very crowded and can scare anyone traveling looking for peace and quiet. So we made a, a vlog uh, showing our day in São Miguel dos Milagres and also in Maragogi. It's really nice and you can check it out here in the channel. São Miguel dos Milagres has become one of the quietest options for those visiting the Costa dos Corais. With inns right on the sand and small rustic villages in São Miguel dos Milagres, the beaches are practically wild and quieter than in Maragogi. From there, it is also possible to take one of the delicious raft trips to the natural pools. Check out our vlog we made for Maragogi, São Miguel dos Milagres and Recife. And the first beach is Bahia do Sancho and Bahia dos Porcos. Fernando de Noronha is one of the most dreamed destinations by Brazilians, but a few years ago it also became a dream place for travelers from all over the world. For several years, Bahia do Sancho was considered the best beach in the world in the TripAdvisor Traveler's Choice ranking. In 2022, the beach ranked 7th among the top 10 beaches in the world. So you can't even think about excluding this beach from any list of the best beaches in Brazil. Bahia do Sancho is a beach located in the National Marine Park of Fernando de Noronha with restricted and controlled access to keep this natural paradise always preserved. The beach is wonderful both from the top of its natural lookout point and from the bottom of its sands. Between these different heights, you have to face a staircase carved into the rocks. Take your snorkeling gear because there you will discover one of the most crystal clear waters you've ever seen, with lots of marine life. In the right corner, particularly, it is possible to find schools of fish and even sharks. But you can't forget Bahia dos Porcos, which is the next to Bahia do Sancho. From the top of the Dois Irmãos Lookout, you have a spectacular view of this beach, one of the postcards of Noronha. And if you like this video and the tips I gave to you, like the video and subscribe to the channel to receive all our videos. And if you are a little bit lost with your travel, we can help you to plan it. Check in the description the link or send us an email to onlinebrazilchannel at gmail.com and we can help you with our program to consult you with your travel. We will make like a video call and help you to buy your tickets, to book the hotels, to choose the best bars and restaurants, uh, to pick up the best tours and places to go, what to eat. So if you are interested, click in the link in the description or send us an email. Besides this, you can still become a member in our channel and help us to keep our work or buy our products. Uh, check all the details in the descriptions and remember all the wings to book your hang glidings now and paragliding in Rio are in the description. If you have any questions, leave, leave it in the comments that we will be pleasure, it will be a pleasure to answer you. So guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and I wish you a safe trip to Brazil. Bye!